Who's ready for a swim? <laughs> hey guys, it's me, AJ. <laughs> Welcome back to another video, and I got some special news. Oh my god, like, okay, I gotta calm down. I have to calm down. There's a reason for that. Oh my god, that mask made my nose super sweaty. No joke. Ah. Okay, alright, alright. Um, um, uh, uh, Try not to get a little emotional or something like that. Um, so today, uh, I got some special announcements. First things first, um, as you guys may know, we just hit our very first, first sub goal. We had just hit 1,000 subscribers. Like, holy shit. It only took us, like, three years. It, like, that's how much it took me, like, three years. Uh, three years of all that content work, so worth it. Like, I just realized this morning, and I was freaking out. Like, I was pinching myself because I didn't know if this was real or not. But then when I looked closer, it was like, wow. I mean, who would have thought that I made it that far just by continuing to do what I love, which is YouTube. Honestly, guys, I just want to say to the bottom of my heart to thank you every single last one of you for all the support and love you have gave me over the years and it's crazy to know this all started when i actually got into social media so because of this uh well i will say we are celebrating but also i kind of want to have you guys to get to know me a bit more not just by through you know things i do so oh I, I'm speechless to be honest with you. I really am. Hearts to my family, my friends, my fans, my viewers, and of course, the Forgers community, the Minecraft roleplay community that we formed to provide you the content you guys like to see from us. It means a lot because honestly, doing all those Minecraft roleplays is like one of my favorites to be honest. Uh, second will go by gaming as well. I love playing games so much. So, of course, I, I love doing that in my channel as well. Uh, and, of course, reaction videos and, you know, others. Like, I would do others sometimes. It's just, like, if I have the motivation to... <laughs> because, um, well... I won't... It's crazy to know how this all started and I got to where I am because of you guys. So, I'm gonna tell you a little bit about myself, you must know. Um, first things first. Before this all happened, uh, well, when I was little, um, I started watching YouTube probably when I was like 9 or 10 or something. Uh, we used to go from place to place sometimes. We went from living to a grandparent's house to, of course, living with a friend's house to pretty much get to here and for myself to just move on as well. Um, so the history about me is that, like, I used to start YouTube, um, kind of like how you start high school. Like, I started YouTube just as I started high school. I was 15 years old and I started YouTube in 2017, and that's when the videos came in. Um, <laughs> It was a beginning year for me in 2017, so um, there wasn't really much going on until I started posting and uploading and such. I was I was starting off small. That's how it works on YouTube. When you first get in, you just start small. I used to use a phone. I used to basically record games on my phone. I used to have bad, either it's bad quality or bad uh, uh, audio quality or just, you know, weird, cringy-ass content in general. But some of you guys still watch it. And basically, the social media I start interacting with everybody alongside my YouTube used to be an app that exists, which was Google+. Plus. Now, yes, that app is gone. It left since, you know, it left, um, I think it was three, four years ago. I can't really remember. It was a good app for me because pretty much that's how I first started interacting with people calmly. And then I moved to Twitter and then got to Discord. I wasn't really fond of Discord until... Hell, you know, 
my friends, including some content creators, start getting on that as well. Discord is a great app for all of us to game, record stuff together, and all that stuff. It's a really cool app, and I've been using it a lot lately. I feel like I use it a lot more than freaking Twitter. Don't get me wrong, I love Twitter. I use it a lot. I used to post my stuff, my art. I used to post it, like, with my, um, of course, when I want to say something in my mind, all that stuff. Um, as I moved on through that, uh, I continue to expand my content further and further away. Well, no, no, hold up, sorry. Ah, fuck. My wording. I continue to believe in myself and just to keep fighting and just keep growing as much as I can. And I have met so many great people in the process as well. Um, and it's cool, it's amazing. So... First thing is, uh, a YouTuber that I got inspiration to continue doing this stuff. I actually watch a lot of YouTubers, even the most famous ones. And <laughs> I watch any variety of YouTube videos as well because there's just so many. Um, but my most favorite YouTuber would have to be, of course, uh, you don't have to guess. The Famous Films, a Minecraft roleplay YouTuber who has done videos. Like, since he was, you know, um, also a teenager. And then he started developing and growing, and then started doing more Minecraft roleplay videos, and such as his famous FNAF series and all that stuff. I, he was like my idol, and, you know, I loved everything about him. He was a cool, cool content creator. Uh, I loved watching him every single day. I first discovered them through my friend Tyler, who we we used to go to school together. He's like a FNAF fan, like a complete FNAF fan, if I would be honest. I love FNAF and his fan games. I plan on probably playing more. I had to get back to Security Breach at some point where I left off because honestly, I'm not going to leave a game incomplete even though I have been so busy with work. I work now. But YouTube will always be my favorite thing to do. Um, so I got to know Brian. I started to support him in any way possible. His merch, membership, you name it. And then, um, well, basically, I... This is a way of trying to learn. Like, you learn from another content creator by just their content. And then try to use that as a way to create your own content as well. Um, funny enough, for those of you who basically see me around his streams or premieres back then, I used to moderate his Twitch and, and his YouTube alongside his Discord before I moved on to do my own stuff as well, and then started to create content for you guys as well. And it's cool to know that uh, that's how, how you will probably get your ideas from, not just by, you know, your own perspective, what you see in life, but to everybody else and try to see if you can implement that for your own ideas easier. Yeah, Brian will always be my idol. Alongside the community that he's also in, which is, of course, uh, the Origins community. Uh, yeah, the, ro the roleplay uh, community that me and my friends made was inspired by Dad. Uh, it's a really cool community, too. You guys should definitely support them as well. Uh, there are a lot of content creators there that I just love too. Like all the support and they get and all the love they deserve because of all the hard work they have done. And, you know, it's a beautiful thing. Yeah, that's the beauty of YouTube. I made a couple of friends on the way while trying to do things on my own. And then also try to see if my friends like to join me on this journey, which has been a blast. 2018 was when I started began to fully do this stuff. Um, random content, like I said. Although I did have to take a break at some point since I've been so busy with school. But in 2019, I started to be more active. And then in 2020, um, in 2020, I started to do more content through my, my computer and PC that I used to have back then. And it wasn't much, but it was still some decent content that I did, too. <laughs> Funny enough, um, I will probably show you a bit of my most popular videos that I learned. 
that I actually had on my YouTube, and uh, we'll get back to that in, uh, just as soon as I finish this conversation. In 2020, I started to hang out with more friends, uh, got to know more people. I mostly, uh, in 2020, I started hanging out with this other YouTuber, uh, an, an awesome friend, of course, and a really, really talented content creator as well, big Mario fan. Um, and I got to know him and his friends as well, and I got to know him just by his content and how hilarious and awesome he is. Through prom hunts to Never Have I Ever, uh, to from Uno to KOA, which is Kingdom of Astra, a, a thing that isn't really a thing anymore. But, you know, he has been helping me out with a lot of the roleplay stuff that we've been doing in FTR. So that's why his... Of course, this channel will always be in the link in the descri uh, description of my FTR feds because he has really cool assets and he's really talented, so go check him out as well. Um, on top of that, uh, in 2021, I started to grow more, got a new PC, been working a lot, earning a lot of extra money, and then started doing all this content. And 2021 was the year when we started the uh, Forges community, but... In a negative note, it was kind of also a bad year for me for my social media life. A lot has happened to me in 2021 through social media. But I was able to just move on from it and just grow from it. I just grow from it and then just learn from it as well. And I I always like to own up to my mistakes if anything. If I do something wrong, I'll own down to them. And still, I had to stand down to my grounds as well. Um... So, in this year, I'm trying to do more for you guys. And as you can see, I'm now doing freaking TikTok and shorts. Like, when did that happen? Yeah, those shorts are getting a lot of love too, so I'm obviously gonna keep doing more of that. Um, getting back to gotcha videos, I'll do that soon too. Try to complete FTR, that's another thing on my list. Complete some games that I haven't completed yet, also on my list. Especially Kingdom Hearts, I love that game so much. And if I was to ever do a Minecraft roleplay of Kingdom Hearts, that would be amazing. But I also gotta learn that I also want to do my own roleplays and also collab with others. Which is why I got a special announcement. There's gonna be something special coming to this channel soon. But you have to wait because it's in the works. But it might be coming sooner than what you actually expect. And you guys are gonna love it. I still get a lot of love and support from my family because they're nearby me. They're always with me in heart. <laughs> I don't let a lot of full-time jobs affect what I do on YouTube. I never let it drop me down or anything. So there's that. So reaching 1,000 subs, I know that how this whole thing will work is that like when you're when you work as a YouTuber and you want that to be an actual job. You will have to do a lot in order to do that. Which I happen to do three of them. Just needed to go through one more. Um, and basically that is to basically show how much you care for your content. Uh, and how much you care for your viewers. By providing them with the feels they love to see from you. And that's what I want to do because you can see by now my channel is filled with random videos. Any variety of videos I'll do. I even done South Park fan animations, which I really do love doing because I actually love to show South Park. See, this is literally what I was talking about earlier. My most popular video I have ever posted on my channel was three years ago, and it was this. Gotcha Life, Bendy X Alice Angel. If you must know, I did play Bendy and the Ink Machine before I completed that game like months ago, and it was fun. <laughs> It's just crazy to know that I did a gotcha uh, live video based on Bendy X uh, Alice because, you know, Bendy X Alice Angel is a ship. A really nice one because, you know, any game will probably have a ship. You, you can't escape from it. This other one was when Fairy Tale Origins was, Season 4 was out uh, from the Origins, which was the breaky ship. I did a lot of editing on Eva's page for this. And it was my first time too because. I, that back, back then, I was a new one to was paint. The rest of these videos are just MMD. Crazy to know that my first ever video on YouTube was a freaking MMD 
short trailer of a series that just got discontinued. Like, holy shit. Why? Oh my god. I still think to this moment that my content is still cringe. Um, the rest of these videos are also some shorts that have recently been uploaded or this collapse I did with other stuff that I credit them for. Uh, this one is another cool one too. Uh, me reacting to one of Brian's videos. Somehow that got a lot of high hopes in fact. And also, this, this first, this episode of FTR where AJ and Maleo became an actual thing. Oh my god, that is insane too. Even my first episode of FTR also got the higher ups too. Um... And that's for the gotcha life. Um, I think I said this already multiple times. I'll probably might say it again. Uh, there's a possibility that I might probably come back to this. Just change out the story a little bit and such. Not like completely, but you know. This actually takes... This is basically AJ's past journeys before um, he started making a, uh, a guild with his other friend, Scroll. Um, and... Pretty much, Jakey, uh, you must know he's a YouTuber who also does Minecraft roleplays and he's also part of the Orange communities. He helped me out by voice acting and it means a lot. Uh, he's a kind, kind person and uh, give him support for that. Yeah, he was he was a really cool person to help me out with that too. Um, yeah, if I was to come back to do uh, a Witness Awakening, I'm not going to have voice acting this time. But don't worry, it's fine. It's still going to be great content. Um, everything else. Um, still says uh and my newest reasons are these ones uh <laughs> this one i posted like whole like 22 hours ago wow um but other than that uh i think that's pretty much it too there was a lot of trolls and arrows i had to embrace while doing all this content and you have to be strong when you're doing all this youtube stuff because sometimes the internet can be intense and chaos and Sometimes toxic. Um, even though real life is hard, still, um, you just have to be this positive person. You always have to be strong no matter what happens. You always have to love yourself, love everything you do, and just, you know, keep going. Don't give up. You, I got you. We believe in you. I, I'm just like saying some weird ass stuff right now. But. I still can't get over the fact that I made it this far. It's just amazing. I love you guys so much, and I promise to not stop. I will never stop. I will not stop making content until the day I freaking die. And that's what people will always say whenever they get to this point or when they're doing YouTube. Because one thing's for sure, and I may be young, but I am capable of continuing to do what I love. And if somebody takes that away from me, and somebody does anything to take that away, I swear I'm like... <laughs> huh. Well, never shut me up by that. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, and thank you so much for 1,000 subs. I love you guys so much. If you guys haven't, make sure to comment, like, and subscribe, and keep watching like, the content I post for you guys. And always, I always say this a lot, Never be nervous. Always leave suggestions on my comments or on my social media. I actually have a Discord server as well, alongside the fan Discord for the reporters as well. So if you guys haven't, make sure you go to that. The link is in the description below. And um, how do we end up this video before uh, we move on? Oh, I know. Holy shit, that's cold. Anyways, uh, thank you guys so much. Uh, I'll see you in the next video. Thank you for 1,000 subs. I love you all. And, um, just tune in. <laughs> this is for you guys. Peace out.